love mascara, like how it opens up my eyes and it makes my eyes look more awake and makes it look bigger. It makes my lash look uh, fuller. The effect I want to achieve with my mascara is kind of a clean, more natural and separated look. It looks more natural, more volume and the length. I feel like my mascara does get kind of clumpy and it sticks together. One reason why I don't like to use mascara is because it actually smudges under my eyes. When you sweat, you tend to smudge. So when I wear mascara, I try not to rub my eyes. In general, I find that mascaras are hard to remove. I think it would be great for me to have a mascara that I don't have to coat it so many times, but to get the same effect of volume and length that I want. I do mascara. One that will actually give me volume, doesn't clump, and uh, easy to remove. Just like any girl, I also want bigger and brighter eyes to make me look, you know, less sleepy, more alert and more beautiful, I guess. But, you know, to be honest, mascara application tends to be a little bit troublesome sometimes and takes a little bit too long for my liking. So today, I'm going to be trying out the new Maybelline Rocket Mascara. It's supposed to be really easy to apply and in just a matter of seconds, you can get all that you want in eye makeup without everything that you don't want. So. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a try now. Okay, so now I'm gonna do the volume test and I'm gonna be testing volume and clumping and the difference between uh, Maybelline's Rocket Mascara and Brand X. So let's see the results. So now what I'm gonna do is to be putting Brand X first on my right eye. So now I'm gonna put the Rocket Mascara on my left eye. I've used the same number of coats on uh, both my left eye and right eye with the Rocket uh, Mascara and Brand X. Both mascara actually does give me volume, but between the two, I can really see that there's a difference. Like uh, Brand X gives me a lot, a lot of these like very disgusting clumps that look like cockroach legs. Uh. Yeah, so <laughs> that's not very nice. So now I'm gonna do the smudge test. Obviously, a lot of us hate it when our mascara smudges and makes us look like, you know, like a panda. When we're out in public, it's just the worst. So right now, I have uh, Brand X on my right eye and a uh, Rocket Mascara on my left. So what I'm gonna do for the smudge test is to be putting a bit of moisturizer on both of my hands because, you know, mascara smudges when we have oil or sweat going to our eyes. So I'm gonna be rubbing my eyes to see which one smudges more. Okay, how do I look? Wow, very sexy. I guess it's pretty clear cut that uh, Brand X is a lot more terrible at being smudge proof. And yeah, although if you're going for the very tragic and sad look, I guess you have to go for Brand X lah because then you look like you really have been crying for like 3 days, 3 nights non-stop. Yeah, but overall, I still say the Rocket Mascara is better. Next, we have the removal test and you know, the one thing I hate about mascaras is that if it's very difficult to remove and you are like home from a really tired day, you just want to sleep and you know, quickly remove your makeup but it's stuck there and then you have to tuck at it and your eyelashes drop off, oh, it's just annoying. So one of the good things about a good mascara is that it's very easy to remove. So I'm going to be putting some makeup remover on two cotton pads here and I'm going to be simultaneously removing the mascara on both my eyes and on my left eye. I still have the Rocket Mascara and on my right eye, Brand X. This is after one swipe. A lot of the Rocket Mascara is gone already, um, but a lot of Brand X is still remaining, especially for the top lashes. Okay, so after the removal test, I found that the Rocket Mascara is actually really quite easy to remove and I'm kind of surprised because just now during the smudge test, it was really hard to smudge so I thought that would mean that it's really difficult to remove but you know it's really quite easy to remove and I checked the cotton pad and there were no like eyelashes on it so none of my precious eyelashes are destroyed in the process. Okay, my thoughts on the Rocket Mascara, I really quite like it. I think it's really really very very easy to use. Uh. It's just, you know, apply and then it takes really very fast to dry up. I really hate it when mascara doesn't dry and it gets really wet and like smudges the rest of your makeup and when you're late, right, it just makes you so angry because you have to remove everything. So this one dries really fast and it doesn't smudge and it's really really easy to remove. So if you're looking for a quick and easy mascara that can also get the job done, you can try out the new Rocket Mascara from Maybelline and the price is really affordable at only $18.90 so it's available at all Watsons, Guardian, Sasa and select supermarkets. Bye!